excuse me, welcome back everyone. Death of 13, more, um, Metal Warriors, as soon as I can get my controller to start working again. Oops. Okay, everything looks like it's working. I wanted to show off this real quick. I forgot, there's a controller setup button. You can actually see all the different robots. I should have showed you guys at the beginning. But you can, and you can do select to practice. So you can be anybody! You can be this guy! And his power dive! That's one way to learn, and I think this is actually one of the multiplayer levels. Oh yeah, that's uh, invincibility. I think that shows up in one of the missions. There's Prometheus. His mega cannon! <laughs> Flame cannon! And uh, the ballistic, so that's what it's called. With that. With that. Oh, you can just hold that. That's kind of nifty. And then its shield. Oh yeah, I forgot about its shield. And spider. With its drone. And its web. And its crappy little bullets. And bouncing bullets, because why not? And the zip roller! And big shield. Chain attack. Anyway. Just kind of wanted to show that off real quick. When last we left off, that red low in the sky is from Dorado City. Oh, we're still in South America. Axe's forces are burning the city so as to leave us nothing to capture. <laughs> Those bastards. Captain Stone's group will proceed to Zone 4 of the city. Not one or two or three, but four. Your job is to keep the Axis forces from destroying the base. Pay no attention to that large caterpillar looking thing on the minimap. <laughs> Only a couple levels left, guys. I think two after this. This is about as far as I've ever made it. I've made it to the not. This is a two parter. I've made it to stage eight, um, and I've never beaten it. Even in my practice runs, I was doing a little while ago, so. There's probably going to be a little saves coming. I humbly ask your forgiveness. But hey, at least we'll hopefully get to see the end of the game. In the meantime, there's mines after us. So get the hell out of there. Okay, that takes care of them. Ah, come back here, little car. You have goodies. Uh, he has a crappy little gun. I'll take it. Whatever. What are you? Ah, oh, that's a better gun. So this... No, not the... Ah, oh, damn it. This gun is horrible for this section. Okay, well, at least we can still fly. Those guys have grenade launchers and power blades. But they're easily killed. Just gotta find an arc they can't get to. I don't know if I actually want to do this one, but we'll go ahead. There's a couple different paths you can use to get through the city. Um, I don't have missile launchers, so I ain't taking this path. Hmm. Probably a good thing that I opened that door then. Oh, my bullets went away. My sucky bouncing bullets. Oh god. Sweet lord, no. Yeah, they're back. Jerks. Oh god, there's one down here too. I hope I don't die. That would be really irritating. Oh god. Yeah, we died. See, the problem with the green ones is they do, like, um, three missiles or something. Okay, let's not get that crappy power up this time. It's not bad. Oh, so that first one's random. What do you have for me this time? Is it, is it off? No, oh, it's two. There's an old one. I don't know what's up with the glowing Prometheus and why they don't work. That might be the missile launcher I want. Zone 3. Let me in. Let me in. Let me in. Huh. Trying to cause another cave in. Oh well. We'll go up again. Why not? What's the worst that could happen? Wish I had power for again. Oh god, help us! test run, and this wasn't nearly this difficult. Problem is, you can't go up too high, because, well, the game won't let you. <laughs> okay, that 
Ah, God. He took a sword blow and was still there. <laughs> and all those stupid things down here. Want some health. Yay, we're down here. Nope. Nope. Don't want to have it. Oh, but I should have killed him. Stop that. Health. Give me the healths. I'm going to do a little more exploring than I would normally do in this section. Basically, is this level is just get to the right as fast as you can. Music suite, though. Very Mega Man. I'm surprised Capcom didn't make this. Red alert. Oh god, my arms. <laughs> Going back to the start of the level just because I don't want to use up my uh, continues. A hell. <sighs> Ooh, that's much better. I think we got it this time. There we go. This is where we were earlier with those havocs. I guess I just wasn't destroying enough of the, enough of the area. Hey, there's another one. Oh, I guess I should open this, huh? Whatever. No, it's already off. Duh. Don't screw up my missiles. It's um, actually not a very good mech for this next section. <laughs> because... Three large Axis units are just ahead. Don't let them destroy the base in Zone 4. Now when he says units, he doesn't mean like a group of guys as a unit. He means three large mechs. Like mechs the size of a city. Don't go too high or mines will kill you. So yeah, you, you can't stop them as the Prometheus, I think. There he is. And he does those, like the super cannon. Only he's portable. Two swords. Jump. I used to make these a lot harder to kill than they actually are. I used to like jump on their head and shoot them. There's actually a ballistic at the base, which isn't bad at them. You can get parked right up on top of their head. And then once you're on their head, you can just spam plasma shots at them. Which is pretty nice. Uh-oh. I guess you can get three if you're fast enough. This is where watching the speed demos really comes in handy. And the other one's down here. And they shoot missiles on their back. That's unfortunate. Yes. Do that. I need to remember to save at the beginning of the level so I don't use up the last of my continues. But you get the basic idea for killing them. Fairly straightforward. But holy crap, the first time you see these when you're a little kid, it's like, oh god, what am I supposed to do against them? Ah! They're so big and 